Good morning, Mr. Pascal. Can you tell us a little bit about your hotel? Good morning, Asma. My name is Pascal Dupuis. I'm the general manager of the most anticipated uh, opening of 2016 for the Address Hotel and Resort brand, which is part of IMA Hospitality Group, the home ground Dubai dy dynamic uh, with uh, three very distinctive brands uh, for hotel and residents. And we are going global, so very exciting for the Address to uh, open a new Hotel, it's been six years we have not opened an hotel, so it's very exciting. And the Address Boulevard will have many uh, things to offer. The main thing is going to be the next uh, new iconic building in downtown, the center of now, where we will have a Culvillinaire uh, building, which will be the second tallest building in uh, downtown, the sixth tallest in Dubai and the 36 tallest in the world. It's 368 meters. It's a mixed use, so we have residents and hotel, which is what we do at the Address Hotel and Resorts. We will have many new features with the Address uh, Boulevard. Number one, we will have the first uh, you know, dining experience, signature dining of uh, the Address. We're launching this new dining experience, which is going to be the uh, a bit like a home feel and a big open plan where you have uh, various areas like uh, the dining room, the living room, the kitchen area, the dressing room. Will literally you sitting inside a dressing uh, wardrobe? We'll have a great international cuisine. We will have a great lifestyle of uh, style of dining between you know very classic, very nice, very uh, sharing concept, family. Eat whatever you like at any time. There will be no breakfast time, no lunch time. So it's a very new, innovative and creative uh, lifestyle dining that we're launching at the address. We are also dedicated a full spa, uh, full floor for the spa. It's 700 square meter, which will have a very good feature about uh, treatment rooms, fitness, gyms, studios. We'll be able to do some, uh, you know, uh, like yoga classes and we will have nutritionists, so basically it's a spa destination where you can literally stay all day. We will have also a dedicated outdoor spa pool, just for the spa user, full view of the Burj Khalifa. The, uh, this, uh, the hotel will be very much an uh, urban resort. We'll have three distinctive pools, so additionally to the spa pool, we will have the main pool, but we will also have a family pool. The hotel will be very much a family destination. The family pool will have special uh, private cabanas, will have shallow waters, great swimming pool, splash area, you know, slides, so great for families. We are a destination for family because we will be connected to the Dubai Mall, which is uh, obviously the biggest mall in the world. We will be very close to the opera as well, so we will have the uh, hotel will be very, uh, the official partner of the opera. Many other features will be like the size of the rooms, the fact that all our suites are connected as well with uh, an extra room, so two bedroom suites. So it's a great family destination. The location is obviously downtown where everything's happened, the center of now. So we're very proud to launch this new product uh, later this year. Uh, what type of guests are you targeting? Well, because of the location, which we are near the DIFC and the EMA Square, so obviously the corporate will be uh, one, of our, uh, one, of, one of our targets for sure and the relationship we already have with all corporates. But we will be definitely focusing on the leisure market because of the location, because of the urban resort being spa destination, great for family. So we're looking at the GCC market, we're looking at the Indian market, we're looking at the Chinese market, very focused on European market as well with the UK, Germany. So it, it will be a good mix of leisure and, and corporates. From your point of view and your group as well, where do you see the tourism going in the Middle East and UAE especially? Well, specifically for Dubai, because I can talk about Dubai, I think uh, the tourism is growing every year. We've seen the figures growing. Uh, just talking about downtown area, with the arrival of the Dubai Opera, I think it's going to bring a more dynamic uh, and completely change the dynamic of, uh, of downtown. You have Dubai parks as well. We have many other uh, you know, features coming. It's a, it's a leisure destination. It's a tourist destination. It's a corporate destination. Uh, the fact that we're also launching uh, with IMA Hospitality Group the mid-market, which is a very growing market as well, with our new brand called Rove. 
I think the dynamic is going. It's following the Ima Hospitality Group is really much following the vision of the Dubai 2020, which is the growth of hotel and you know attractions, and it's good. Uh, finally, do you have any messages that you are keen to share with the ATM members and your viewers? Well, I just say, you know, if you have not visited Dubai, you know, it's time to do it. And uh, exciting uh, to launch a new address hotel after six years. And I'm sure we'll, we'll not be disappointed. My team and I are preparing the opening and we're welcoming uh, all of uh, our guests uh, from, uh, you know, later this year. So please do visit us. It will be great for, uh, for us to welcome you there. Uh, Mr. Pascal, it was a pleasure talking to you and good luck with the opening. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you.